Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please remember to take what resonates and don't manifest the rest. Thank you for all your likes, subscribes, and shares. I super, super appreciate it. Okay. So... Five of Pentacles, King of Swords, and the Sun. So, either somebody you ghosted or somebody ghosted you. I, I feel like it's somebody who left you out in the cold. Found out the truth. Could be a Queen of Pentacles. Found out the truth about hurting a Queen of Pentacles world yeah that they were stalking could be a cancer this new moon I'll tell you it has completely rocked a lot of people's worlds because there are super truths coming out about a lot of different things People are finding out who their real friends are and who's not for them. Yeah. Challenge here is stalker. Masks are coming off. Page of swords. And whoever this person is may have to apologize to get back into your energy. They keep, it, it's like, it's like they keep testing the waters, like hit or miss type energy. There are rules, rules of engagement, cancer energy in the most recent past. Now they're stuck. King of Wands is now stuck putting their life back together because of this truth, whatever it is that was just exposed. Five of Swords in the immediate future. Nine of Wands, Nine of Swords. So, damn. Somebody's seriously fighting this truth. They don't want to believe it. Nine of Wands, Nine of Swords. And they're stressing now. I feel like whoever these people, I feel like there's more than one. There might be up to three. And they're all fighting with each other. They may cause an argument in your life, but uh, I would simply walk away. Yeah. Tell them. <laughs> Go fix yourself. Eight of Wands, King of Wands. So whoever this King of Wands is, they need to go fix themselves. They need to go heal before they come button into your life with that five of swords. Eight of wands. I can't make it up, man. It keeps popping out. That is the outside influences. You're about to hear from this person. And they're going to tell you what they did because they don't have no choice. Like I said, rules of engagement. And whatever they did, it went back. Now they're having to deal with the Five of Swords, the Five of Wands, and the Ten of Swords. So whatever they wanted for you, they are now dealing with. And, you, and, and they may even call you or text you or talk to you and say, Hey, you know, I'm sorry for what I did. You can't stop anybody else's karma, Scorpio. All you can do is hang in there with your own and keep going two of swords this person is very confused as to why something didn't work here because you're healed four of swords ace of wands you healed the swing swing your prep your brand new passionate beginning like i said the rules of engagement here because somebody didn't somebody didn't 
there are rules. And somebody didn't pay attention to those rules. Now they don't have any choice but to make some kind of offer. I feel like this person might be sick. Knight of Cups and Judgment. Judgment from the lies. It's over. King of Cups, Devil. Yeah, so this is over for somebody. There's There's been some kind of judgment call or justice call here um, with whatever's been exposed. What is this spirit? What is this five of, Pentac five of Pentacles? Yeah, you're healing. Your rest, the way you rested, and, and it, it feels like somebody caught up on their rest, stopped this. It's like you took a step back, and in taking that step back, all of this came out. Instead of trying to make it happen with your will, you took a step back, let it happen, and it happened. High Priestess. You already knew this. I mean, you already knew what this was. You already knew these people were stalking you. Could be a Knight of Cups. Somebody who may be in love with you, but they fought you 110% instead of coming right to your face. Yeah. Obsess much? Queen of Pentacles is exposed. The devil, the manipulation, it's been exposed to the fullest extent with that sun. You are stronger than that. Leo and Capricorn energy. Now you have this knight of pentacles coming towards you. And they are... I mean... This feeling... <laughs> And I hate to compare it to this because I don't do politics, but I feel like this was like when Hillary Clinton didn't get elected. <laughs> and everybody started flipping out. People were crying and stuff. So something that, that this devil did didn't work because you were stronger than that. Like I said, there's a rule, rule here that, that somebody broke trying to come for you. Uh, in the ethers and and they're still doing it you know that they're still trying to figure out a way to get your energy but I feel like they they fight in their own demon that they sent because okay so if you play with stuff like magic which you know is going to be come to an end manipulation energy man manipulation now that we have the Pisces new moon it's dreams and, and people are not going to be able to manipulate timelines anymore and they've been trying to do that for the longest especially this past year and they're not going to be able to do it anymore so you're going to be able to move forward in time I'm not saying it's going to happen immediately but the ten, ten of wands you don't have to go nowhere Whatever this chariot is, it's yours. Could be a car. Somebody owes you this. What is this five of swords? What is this five of swords? Next week I will start doing Libra and Aquarius on my channel. Somebody's fighting with the truth. Can't fight the truth. Truth is truth. This King of Wands. This handsome devil. Oh, okay. So now they're discovering that you're solid 
and that you're comfortable. Now they want to come love you. Now, I don't feel like this is somebody you know in the immediate future. But I think this is what they were trying to stop. It was a two of cups. And this person found out the truth about you through all the chaos, through all the muck muck. And I feel like they're coming forward. Right now, they're, they're putting their own life back together because of something that happened. They got in a fight with somebody, or they're about to, over the truth about you. Somebody tried to stop your chariot, and they didn't succeed. Now they're going through a series ending of their own. That's why they're having to put their life back together. And now they see you as the Ten of Cups. They understand now you can't buy this. Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. That that it is what it is, you know. Um, you might be able to buy pretty much anything else in this world, but you can't buy the Ten of Cups. That's total emotional fulfillment. Family, wishes, dreams and you being stuck is over that's come to an end you're now allowed to move forward possibly even go on a vacation with that eight of wands oh somebody hates this oh you shining baby you shining good celebratory energy over your wish could be something you've been working on or something that you've been going towards look can't make it up five of swords on the and the three of swords so this person is fighting shadows because they created them And understand that any shadows that you create, you will fight. Because you have to go through the dark night in order to have this ending and this rebirth. But these three people, whoever they are, and I do feel like there's more than one here, tried to stop a star from shining. Tried to stop a wish from happening. And they got, they got, they got blocked. Now they're all fighting each other. And you're able to go forward. Go forth and multiply. You're able to go forward and have whatever you've been working on. Whatever wish you made. It could be travel. And whatever they were trying to stop, it's over. They can't stop it no more. Here's that Ace of Wands. It came out on the Two of Swords. It's like, almost like, where do I go next kind of energy. It's nice. It's real nice. Chwing, chwing. What is my passion? Where am I going? What do I want now? Now that that's over, what do I want now? I want the Ten of Pentacles. And with time and investment, you will get it. As I said, rules of engagement. What is this page of pentacles as the final outcome? Page of cups, king of pentacles. Ooh -wee. So somebody's about to take a leap of faith towards going towards you. Six of Wands, the Fool, the Six of Swords. Damn. And the King of Swords. King of Pentacles. So, Scorpio, you may have two offers coming in and an apology. 
got a page of cups and a page of pentacles here king of, and a king of wands and a king of uh king of pentacles yeah this person knows that they they can't move forward without doing without apologizing or trying to make up for something that they've done here they know if they carry this baggage they gonna walk off a cliff and, and and I mean not in a good way the eight of wands came out sideways so that tells me that if this message isn't sent and this apology isn't made which it doesn't have to be an apology in real life it can be an apology uh, energetically to this Queen of Cups and they don't make up for what they've done that that Eight of Wands is going to be turned around backwards so backwards let's get some more information yeah I knew it somebody has to be fair to you especially where a home or a house or Four of Wands is concerned. Because Spirit says so. Otherwise, you face the tower. Taurus and Scorpio energy. Aries energy on the board. Capricorn. More Scorpio. Aquarius. Cancer. And Leo. So, I feel like your bliss is coming in. Whatever you wish for here, Scorpio, it's coming. It's a brand new beginning, and it's fair. It's like one hand washes the other type energy. And whatever these people were doing, they found out the truth, and now they've been stopped. So it's not over for you. I, like I said, I feel like you might be doing some traveling. Be aware of where you're going and what you're doing because there's lots of things going on in the world. I did feel like there's two people coming towards you. It looks like love. It looks like a love situation. Somebody from a distance wants to court you but you're not sure main female like I said take it as it resonates because you could be the male or you could be the female here a new pathway a new journey opens up for a wealthy man something is is being made right here some kind of manipulation that you outgrew and this person <clears throat> I feel like there's more than one. They may they they may be quite a few that are, are fighting their way to get to you. To make up for something that they did in the past. That they know that they have to make up for. Spirit has done the smackdown here. It's been a smackdown, or it's about to be. Like I said, rules of engagement. Somebody, somebody pushed, pushed the envelope. The waiting game, waiting on something to grow. Being patient, triumphant success. Memories of love, firm foundation. So, the four of wands. This could have something to do with a past, um, a past situation that you had power over during this very trying time, because you stayed in your heart center. You didn't, you didn't try to manipulate something. Strength over the six of cups. 
maybe of what you thought it was supposed to be and then you changed your mind because you knew that there was some work that needed to be done here and you decided to concentrate on that instead of whatever these people were doing I'm hearing it's none of my business like I said you stuck to your truth and you turned your back on this person you turned your head on this person I didn't even noticed that before somebody could have a nose ring because I see a nose ring on this I never saw that before maybe that's not what that is but that's what it looks like Like I said, I never really noticed that before. Don't know why I'm noticing it now, but it could be relevant. All in a golden afternoon. Somebody lost their creative spark. That's what they're fighting to get back. All must have prizes. Yeah, somebody... Uh, somebody was trying to please everyone. And in and, and doing so, instead of trying to do what was right by you, they tried to please all the wrong people. Now they're regretting it. Because life is brief. Oof. Somebody might even be leaving. And they have to accept the fact that everybody's different and that they misjudged you in a way that could have been the last nail in the coffin. It could be fatal for this person and I'm, I'm, I'm going to be nice about that. I'm going to be nice about that. They are in a downward spiral right now with some kind of truth about you that just came out. Yeah, someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. I don't know if you're going to pick up the phone or not. Because I do feel like these people were, were fighting you all the way to the finish line, whatever that means. Interested, conversing more, awaited message, arrived, text, call, email. Like I said, somebody's about to contact you because they're not left with a choice but to face some kind of truth here. They don't want to, but they have to. Something maybe that you do for a living that you really shine at and you may be able to um, move physically move to a new home or um, you know uh, go on vacation unconditional love Cupid's arrow damn receiving what you need soulmates you've got new love coming in Scorpio and, and I'm gonna say this Whatever this old person did to you, don't let it stop you from the new. Because whatever's coming in for you is, is very nice. They're dealing, somebody else is dealing with a bad situation. They may be going through a divorce and leaving a third party behind. Now, I'm not saying that the, you even, you might not even know this person because there's somebody new coming in. Something that you wished for. Something that you really wanted. And then you've got another person here who's fighting because they were stalking you. They could have been married. And they're getting ready to leave because they were caught. They were caught trying to manipulate you in some way. caught
exposed, ghosted. Now you're going to hear from two different people. Now this could be an email, text, call, or something like that. Somebody's behind the computer really, really, I mean, like I said, I feel like this person can't stop looking at you, can't stop staring at you, can't stop. And then this is a new person. And both of them want this. But I feel like you're in this energy, possibly still heartbroken. Get out of the past, whoever you are, because the past isn't there anymore. It doesn't exist anymore. So who, even whoever this old person is, they're being forced to change their ways because spirit's not leaving them any choice but to stick to their truth. Otherwise, you know, they're going to be caught in, and left in the past just like anybody else who, uh, who decides to stay there. And you can. You can choose right now whether you want to stay in the past or you want to move in the future. And I do feel like, Scorpio, you're ready to move into a new future. Call me when you're sober. Only want what you can't have. Materialism, illusions over reality, and stress overload. Faded, written in the stars. Someone tried to block fate. Romance, divine timing, open borders, intuitive relationship, liberation, freedom, want to swap de destinies but being stopped. This person is, their whole world is being shattered right now because they put too much faith into materialism over, over their, over what was real. You know, they, they thought they could buy everything instead of, like I said, you can't buy the Ten of Cups. And it says, remember that you can't change anyone but yourself. And you must forgive if you want to be free. Do it for you, not for them, but for you. Stop pushing against what is and align with it and move on absolutely like I said ain't no sense in staying in the past you don't live there no more you're moving into a whole new timeline and if you give it a chance it's what you asked for it's what you wished for it's beautiful not everybody's the same Invasion, boundaries, violated, dominance. Collision of beliefs, styles, attitudes, energies. Please don't lose hope. You see clearly. So, if you thought that this person was invading your boundaries, you were probably right because you kind of saw that. And, you, and, and it's like, Whatever this person painted about you, like I said, the truth has come out. There's, there's no way around it. So don't lose hope because what you saw, you saw. What you saw, you saw. Don't doubt that. But forgive because you must move into a different timeline. Clear your space. Clean your space. And I can't recommend that more. Smudge. Clean. Wash everything. Vacuum everything. Sweep everything. Sweep out the old. It is time for a new paradigm. It is springtime, babies. Spring forward. We just had daylight savings time happen. The ice queen in reverse. The fire prince in reverse. So, remember that you can take this for you, or you can, the other person uh, may have to deal with it as well. Okay, one, 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 fire prince in reverse. That's, that's a rough one. So, that's optimism, optimism and aggression. 
So I do feel like somebody is going to be in a, in a very aggressive mood and you you just don't entertain it. Just go the other way. Don't don't engage because it's like I said, rules of engagement. There's hits and misses. What you were feeling, you were right. Just be right and take it on the fly. Don't stay in that paradigm because it's testing you to see if you will. It says there are a couple of messages delivered by the fire prince to so take heed as one or both could pertain to you now. Be mindful of starting a fire you can't put out. Aggressive action results in loss. Slow down and don't be so eager to reach your goal. Stay clear of someone else's unbridled ambition and aggression as well. If you, could, if you think you could get burned, you most certainly will, unless you remove yourself from the action. When the fire prince arrives as a challenger, he could also be warning you to, to be careful of burnout. This might pertain to workaholism or obsessively focusing on something you want, excluding all else. You may be afraid to let go, but you must. If you keep going this, the way that you are, truly you won't have any energy left, nor will you see your way through, the path, through your path. It's easy to get lost in the dark when there is no flame to light the way. I couldn't have said that better. All right, the Ice Queen in reverse it says, when the Ice Queen comes to challenge you, she asks you to look at the illusion of ownership. Do you tr believe that you truly own anything in this world? For example, do any of us really own land? Do we own ideas? Or is it, simply, is it that we have simply laid claim to something we believe we're entitled to? Even inspiration is borrowed from spirit and shared by all in the field of divine consciousness that permeates everything. Others have thought of even your most ingenious ideas somewhere else in time. So what? Life incarnate is short. When you transition, you take nothing with you from the material world. The Ice Queen calls upon you to release your hold on your relationships, your belongings, your home, and all aspects of your life, and let life flow as it will. Everything is impermanent, and once you recognize that, everything is seen as the living miracle that it really is, and you won't be frozen into self-induced limitations. That reminds me of, of something I saw in a movie that said, I know my limitations, and then the other person says, well, don't limit yourself. Um... It's time to let go of ownership in general and be grateful for and enjoy what you have been gifted with. Right now. Not in the past. Not in the future. Right in this present moment. And remember that you can't change anyone but yourself. Alright? Well, those are your messages, my baby dragons. Please remember to press the like button, subscribe, and share. And I love you very much. And I'll see you next time.